What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? My name, of course, is Multi Kills HD. Now, uh, today I'm actually reviewing one of my favorite cars in real life and on the game, and I am reviewing the Nissan 2010 GTR. And uh, I gotta admit, this car is amazing, and you know, just the style of it, it just looks amazing. It's one of those cars that, you know, in real life wouldn't look that fast from the side, but when you get up close in front of the back and, the, you know, the front of the car, you hear this engine, you know, you know automatically it is a fast car. Now, uh, a couple things about this car. This car is amazing because of its short gears. Uh, you know, you can go from 1 to maybe 200 and maybe, you know, 5 seconds, 6 seconds, 7 seconds, just depending on, you know, how good of a launch you can actually get. Now, uh, you know, there's a couple of bad things about this car. It's in around 230 range. You know, it just tops out, and, you know, people in Lamborghinis, you know, Bugattis, they're going to catch up about this range. Now, that is one of the downfalls of this car. Hands down, that is one of the downfalls. Now, a couple more people may say, all right, so what is it really, really good at? Well, if you have drag races that are, you know, under a mile, hands down, it's really good. You know, if it's a mile, you know, you're probably going to do pretty well anyways, but, uh, you know, you're not going to be doing as well as you would with a car that is, you know, hands down, better at a mile. Such as, you know, the Lamborghinis, the, uh, you know, the Bugattis, the Ferraris, and, you know, those kind of cars. Now, the traction on this car, overall, you know, it's pretty good. You're able to, uh, you know, zoom in and zoom out of cars. Uh, you know, that is what you really expect from a car that costs around 100000 American dollars. You know, um... You kind of think about that, and this car is actually faster in real life than a Lamborghini in short distances in a mile. And you just kind of wonder, how is this car cheaper, even though it is actually better? I don't know about you guys, but anyways, I'm going to go ahead and finish this video, guys. I do end up getting to 230 miles per hour here in a second. I'll end up showing you guys that. But uh, there's a couple things about this car that I hands down dislike. You know, with this car being so fast in real life, you kind of got to wonder, you know, is 230 miles an hour the right speed for this car to actually top out? Or do you think this car on this game should top out at, let's say, you know, 240? You know, I think 240, 245 range would actually be even better for it. Multiple reasons. It is an amazing car. It sounds amazing. It looks amazing. And in real life, with a quick couple upgrades, good gas in real life, it can go a far distance. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. My name, of course, is Multi Kills HD. Remember to hit that like button and subscribe, and I'm out. Peace.